You're watching Street Level Network, connecting music, media and entertainment. I'm Harvey Goldsmith, you're watching Street Level Network. I came up through uh, Student Union University route where um, I uh, turned up late for a lecture one morning, got nominated to be the student rep and decided that uh, music was lacking at my university and went from there. Uh, I started a club called Club 66, January 1966. Um, I did a local band as the first show and I think the second show was the Moody Blues. So I was very lucky, I grew up in a period of time when lots of the great bands of today were really starting and so just grabbed those opportunities. I trained as a pharmacist so um, music was my love, it was in the house, we listened to it all day long, my family were into music, my cousins were musicians, um, so music was everywhere in, in, uh, when I grew up, so it was a natural thing to get involved in it, I suppose. Uh, well, I started 20 years before <laughs> Live Aid, so Live Aid is probably what I'm known for, but I started in the 60s. I think I just did it two weeks ago. I produced an event um, which I worked with Pavarotti, the classical singer, uh, for 25 years and I just produced a tribute to him because he died a year ago in Petra, which is in the desert in Jordan. It's a 3,000 year old city and uh, probably the best event I've ever done in my life and that was two weeks ago. Keep your aspirations high, don't give up and at every level that you try and go into make sure that works before you go for the big kill. Just start slow, get some small success and learn everything you can possibly learn and learn from your mistakes and then you've got a shot at it. We're promoting, um, you're betting on the 3.30 every day, so it's a horse race. No level of entry, and you've just got to have a prowess to be able to organise, um, never say no, and to have an eye and an ear for talent. And I want young people to come up and show me how to do it and come up with their way of doing it because it's the new generation, you know, they know where it's at. <laughs>